2.0 Start Screen. First, we are going to explore a few items accessible from the Start Screen. It is good to know how to access some of the options and Autodesk services before diving deep into learning Civil 3D. Launch Civil 3D by clicking a shortcut, usually from your PC's desktop, program menu, or taskbar. Civil 3D opens, and your default template file, Drawing 1, is displayed. Next, click on Start. You will notice two more tabs at the bottom of the screen, Learn and Create. Let's focus on the Create tab, the default one. On this screen, we have three sections, Get Started, Recent Documents, and Notifications. The Get Started section allows us to do things like opening files, sheet sets, get templates, such as localized country-specific kits, online, or explore sample drawings on our desktop. The middle section shows a list of recent documents we have worked with. These documents are shown in chronological order. So, if I am looking for a recent document that I don't quite remember the folder as document is saved in, this is a good place to look. Furthermore, I can pin a document to permanently display in this list by clicking on the gray pin in the top right corner. Once I'm done working with that file or don't need to remember it anymore, I can simply unpin it. At the bottom, we have an option to display the files in different modes, big and medium icons with previews or list view modes. Now, let's explore the third section, Notifications. In here, we get notification from Autodesk to make sure our subscriptions and services are up to date and running smoothly. If you are logged into your Autodesk account, you will see the number of items that needs your attention. In my case, I have one item, which is 11 products that need an update. Let's check it out. Click on Updates. A new window is displayed. The icon in the top left corner allows me to see a full list of products. This list will be different depending on your subscription package, but the process is usually the same. Click on My Products and Tools. What is shown here is a comprehensive list of all products in your subscription package. In this case, we have access to the AEC, Architecture, Engineering and Construction Collection, which gives access to software such as Civil 3D, Revit, Recap, Map 3D, and many more. This is a good place to check if you ever need a design software. You may already have access to one in your collection without knowing it. To install a software, simply agree to the terms and conditions and you are on your way. One more thing you can do is to access your full Autodesk account from the menu in the top right corner. Once there, click on the account details, then access my complete list of products and services. Here you can manage your profile or company settings if you have account administrative rights, change contact and billing information, access cloud services, etc. But one of the most useful services is a direct access to Autodesk technical support. To do that, click on the support icon in the top right corner. From there, you can check on updates on your existing support cases or simply create new ones. Then, close your internet browser window to return to the Autodesk portal. Click on Done to close the Account Details window. Next, close the main portal access window to return to the Start screen. This concludes the section on the Start screen. Next, we will start exploring in more details the Civil 3D interface, the working environment.